this literally is of the beaten track. It's in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of forest, and it's in the middle of a golf course. And what is so peculiar about this? Well, a little bit funny to find an alpine style resort resembling what Switzerland, Austria, Germany, Bavaria and so on in a tropical country like Vietnam. Just have a look. Pines. Don't see palm trees here. And the architecture is really inspired by by the European Alpine resorts, I would say. And actually, the name of this is Swiss Bella Resort. And they labeled themselves a five star hotel and a resort. And Google gave them four stars. So let's check it out. Let's see if it really is five or four star hotel. I would say the nature around is stunning or very, very pretty. It's about 1500 meters above the sea level. It's close like seven kilometers to the provincial capital of Lamdong province, Dalat, and they have a free shuttle from here to Dalat like six times a day. So some people are saying, when I read the reviews on the internet, some people are saying this is actually pretty convenient to stay in the countryside and at the same time to have easy means to get to the city. And it's a golf resort and in case you are wondering I paid for the room something like $50 but it's only Monday through Friday on the weekend, the rooms, room rates are doubled or even more. And the restaurant, I would say, is pretty pricey, at least compared to Vietnamese standards. What you can get in the lot in the city is maybe 30% of what they charge you here. You can get a pretty good dinner, Vietnamese meals, of course, in the city for maybe 10 US dollars. But here, I would say 30, 40. And I'm not talking about any drinks with it. And if you want something kind of Western, like a steak or such, you will probably pay pretty penny maybe the same price, about the same price like in the US or in Europe. But the way I look at it is you don't travel, you don't go to other countries to eat your home food. For that you can probably stay home. And here you can see the style of the of the hotel, of the resort. They have a pool, outdoor pool, decent size. And there is one indoor pool which I think currently is out of commission so is it gonna rain or not should I venture further to the hills or should I wait to see how it develops I have to say the grounds are very nicely maintained Everything green, some flowers. 
Yeah, it does look like something is brewing on the horizon. The resort itself is something like seven years old only, so it's fairly new. Let's go in here. There is a little gym in case you are interested. I wish it was raining actually, to tell you the truth. I find something very relaxing in the rain, watching the rain, not necessarily to be soaking wet in the rain somewhere, but sitting in a dry place and watching the rain, that's not bad at all in my book. Oh yeah, karaoke, if you are so inclined. And you can play pool here. And a table tennis. I think I should show you my room in the five star or four star hotel golf resort in Vietnam. Let's take a tour of the room. So this is the room for about 50 bucks. Here some of my stuff and I have a lovely balcony. Okay, let's unlock and step on the balcony. It's been raining this afternoon but it's Pretty nice, pretty green. I would say not your typical picture of Vietnam. I don't know what the typical picture of Vietnam would be for most of the people. My guess is probably beaches or crazy, crazy hustle and bustle of Saigon or French Quarter and the lake in the center of Hanoi maybe some other places in Vietnam but I would bet that it wouldn't be pines and hills and a golf course in Vietnam and let's finish the walk here in the room this somehow is in five star hotels nowadays in Vietnam or maybe somewhere else also because I usually don't uh, stay in five star hotels but I couldn't resist just fifty dollars per night but anyway uh, enough rambling what I wanted to say is that they put those windows in the bathroom so you can take a bath and look outside or the outside can look at you taking a bath your choice what else do we have here ah, the typical closet here is a little safe oh, and I have a bathrobe here and slippers standard flat TV a little fridge fully loaded you touch anything you pay for it and you get some instant coffee tea in two mini bottles of water on the house that's about it I think oh yeah and of course it has AC Sound of rain, isn't it beautiful? They serve very, very delicious breakfast in the morning. Probably the best I ever had in Vietnam. Not probably, for sure, actually. Not only did they have um, Vietnamese meals, but they had also my favorite smoked salmon and 
stuff like that, a decent bread, some even some cold cuts and Swiss cheese. Well, we are in a Swiss resort, at least by the name, so it would be a shame not to have a Swiss cheese here. Well, since it's a rainy day and I am in the middle of nowhere, let's explore nowhere from the top. Actually from a rooftop garden suite 601. <laughs> I don't think I'll get in. Oh wow. Is anyone here? Doesn't seem like it. No luggage. So this is the garden suite in the Swiss hotel with a little balcony and a pretty impressive view. Well, not so shabby. It's been raining all day, not much, but enough to prevent any trekking in the hills around here. But I did see some people playing golf on and off. But from what I have seen, not that I am any expert on golf, I didn't see any next Tiger Woods here. So that's the end of my exploration here I think. So thank you for watching. I hope you found it interesting. Take care and see you next time. Bye bye.